We call this rabbit speed dating because actually it's very similar to The Bachelor. The process takes about 15 minutes for each rabbit and we put them together in a room where they can get to know each other and really kind of see if it's love at first sight. Usually they'll give very clear signals as to whether or not they're going to get along. We narrow it down to the top three and then the adopting family will really make the decision based on the last three that have come through as being the most compatible. I've been volunteering here at the shelter. In April will be 10 years. People ask me, are they happier as singles or as duos? My personal opinion is they're happier as pairs. Rabbits are particular about their partners, highly social animals. I mean, in the wild, they would never be solitary. So we came here today to adopt Tanya. Um, we read about her in the New York Times article and it broke our hearts that no one wanted her because she was just a plain bunny. We wanted to find a partner for Tanya because Tanya has had dates before, but for one reason or another she was never the one selected. There was always another bunny who, you know, appealed more to the adopters than poor little Tanya, uh, who's just another little red-eyed white rabbit. This is Batik. Who's going to be the first candidate? We don't expect to see love at first sight. That happens about one time in 50, maybe. They're each pushing the other one, trying to get the other one to, to groom them first, and nobody wants to back down. Now, you have to watch this circling behavior, this nose to tail behavior, because sometimes when they get in that, that yin yang position and they start circling, that means they're about to break up into a fight. We're probably going to cut this short now, and we don't want them to get too stressed. Hi, Tristan. Hi, would you like to meet a pretty girl? Bachelor number two. Sort of exotic and different. You know how this goes. You've done this before. Easy, easy, easy. This is great. For one thing, they're both comfortable. They're both happy. It's peaceful coexistence. That's what you're looking for. This degree of re relaxation and comfort in each other's presence is, is hard to beat. He's not a great lover, but he's a, but he's very happy to have a companion. He's happy in her presence, that's for sure. This is an arranged marriage. We're looking for compatibility at this point. Romance comes later. Ta-da! Okay, this is the big moment. She's grooming him, she's gro grooming, grooming, grooming. This just went from seven or eight to a 10. Well, this is about as good as it gets on the first date. This is great. Oh, and it's a first kiss. Yeah, she's definitely made her choice. You never see mutual grooming and snuggling on a first intro. I'm so happy. I feel like a proud parent. My little girl is grown up. I feel kind of sad. I can't believe she's leaving. I'm going off with her hubby into the sunset to live happily ever after. 